beautiful people. I am Tiffany and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm reviewing Altre's Melted Hairline in the style Aries in the color 1B. There are six special colors in Aries and I wish I had gotten DR2 Cinnamon Spice or DRFF Chocolate Truffle. Aries has a deluxe wide lace part, which is two, two by five and she has natural baby hairs. She also has a three standard combs, two at the top, one at the bottom. She has the pre-attached elastic band, and she also has a standard band. Aries has the pre-plugged hairline and sideburns. She has the natural inner ear HD lace, Guys, the lace on this was really beautiful. It's HD transparent, really easy to cut, really beginner friendly. to 26 inches she was really big head friendly my head is a medium and I would say she's a medium to large size she fit over my ears she also is a side part Here I'm using my trusty got to be glue spray to adhere the lace. It always works well for me. I'm thinking about trying to even, but the got to be spray works well. Sometimes I add the got to be glue or gel. I'm sorry, got to be gel in the black if I'm wearing it all day, but I don't wear my wigs all day, I just usually take them off. Guys, I use my blow dryer on a cool setting after I'm, I spray the got to be spray on it. Cool helps it to to adhere really well for me and really quickly. I use my elastic band to melt the lace. This is one of the key steps to getting your lace to melt. So if you're not doing this, this is one of the reasons why your lace is not melting. I always use that elastic band. I get mine from Walmart. You can get it from Joann's, Michael's. They're really cheap, but always use that. It always works. using my Fenty Pro Filter in the color 330. It's lighter than my face. I use it in a part because to me, my scalp is a little bit lighter than my face. So I like to use something lighter in my part. And I use a little bit too much. I should have dabbed it off a little bit more, but I didn't dab it off enough. So it was a little bit heavy. But if you're doing this, make sure if you're using a liquid to dab it off a little bit so that it doesn't cake in the parting space. I was able to kind of brush it out a little bit with a tissue.
guys on my hairline I usually use my rare beauty in the color 400 W that's what I use on my face so that's what I use around my hairline Herbal Essence Totally Twisted Curl Boosting Mousse. And I use that to lay down the baby hair. And then after I lay them down, then I set them with the got to be in a black tube. That works well for me. Sometimes if I use the got to be gel first, it gets too sticky. And then it messes all up. So I just set it with the mousse first. And any extra mousse that I have, I just put it on the top of my hair. It kind of slicks it down and just makes it really shiny and pretty at the very top. So then I wrap it up with my silk scarf to kind of help the hairline lay down and keep the baby hair set. <music> It just well, works well for me when I do it like that. And then I add heat. I just use the back of my electric comb. And I have that, I think, on 300. But she is heat resistant up to 400 degrees. So it's fine to use up to 400 degrees on it. And guys, here's the final product. I think she is absolutely gorgeous. Pros, she was really easy to put on. The lace was really easy to melt. She's a really beautiful unit. Um, my cons were she tangles. She's thick, thick, very thick, and she tangles. But overall, do I like her? Yes, I think she is absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. I love this style. I love the waves i love everything about her except for the tangle i didn't get too much shedding but i did get tangling so guys let me know what you think about her in the comments if you're going to buy her or not um, i wish i had gotten her in a different color but the black is really beautiful and like always join the family like share subscribe we're friendly here we're not too friendly, but we're friendly. And I thank you guys for staying this long. I'll see you guys later.